for me. Oh, okay. Yeah, but this internal okay. monologue is reminding me a lot of Max Payne. We did it before. Push the hiss out. No, they said um, that only people with a certain device can survive in whatever thing was going on there, and for some reason us. So that's, I guess that's the device that makes them, like, be able to withstand the effects or whatever's going on. I don't know, man. I, just, I apparently work here. Control points are, are locations that the Bureau have ident has identified as vital junctions of the oldest house. When the appropriate harmonization devices are arranged around the control point in the redacted arrangement, cool, the surrounding area will not experience an unforeseen building shifts. Uh, these control points are discovered by redacted detections uh, of an unobstructed ping using redacted within a 37 foot radius. Numerous researchers have attempted to find control points calling them the nerve junctures of or, or redacted or vulnerable spots of the oldest house. The common factors in these theories is that control points are susceptible to external influence which allows us to stabilize the oldest house and work more uh, confidently inside. Theoretically this technology could be extrapolated to stabilize the oldest house as a whole, but testing has found that certain parts of the building refuse to be redacted. Cool. Gotta love everything being redacted. Why do you have a giant pyramid in your place? Oh, <laughs> how mad looks work instead of redacting. Yeah. This is a fast travel and change my outfit. Cool. Cleanse the hiss corrupted agents. Okay. Are you hiss corrupted, my friend? Is that why you're bent like you? Oh my god, I can't be healthy. <laughs> You okay? And she's gone. It didn't work. The hiss has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out rips them apart. So I just killed that lady. Okay. Jesse, over here. We need to make a plan, Jesse. Oh, you're up there now. What's up, lady? I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. They really like uh, do Android dreams. I'm gonna tell her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen, the Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us, or a few of us. Well, that's an HRA in the chest, okay. Know. Trench, the ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun, an old Bakelite telephone, a direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years but of he's experience. Dead. He might know how to destroy the hiss. Shot himself Where in the, the head. Hotline? It's kept in the communications department through the mailroom. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay. That's my next stop. 
That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. No, I don't. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons, too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. Yeah, it's... it's interesting so far, but... Oh, a phone that has... no dial. Look, I know this is all new to you, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are no stupid questions. There are. Let's talk. The hotline should be in the communications department. Uh, origins of the hiss. Where did the hiss come from? I'm not sure. You said the hiss was here when you entered. Did you see anything like that outside before you came in? No. No, just inside. The source is internal, then. See, the oldest house is a sprawling complex with openings to other places as well. I don't even know where to start looking. But in the context, it's good news. The lockdown holds. The hiss Batman escaping the building phone. would be the end. Pretty shitty world out there, if you ask me, but... I wouldn't want the hiss to destroy it. I'm with you on that, Emily. Okay. You mentioned the oldest house. What is it? This building, the bureau headquarters, the oldest house, is a shifting place. Uh, you've seen it. It transcends its physical limits. I've been to New York a few times. How didn't I notice this place? It's an attribute of the building. This is a place of power. The oldest house doesn't like attention. So unless you're purposely trying to find it, you don't, which is perfect for us. The work we do here is essential, but unstable. The Bureau prefers not to be noticed. And we need strong walls to make sure nothing gets out. So without you, I never would have found the front door. Okay. 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 She's talking to somebody. It's not me as... as yeah, she's talking to something in here. This trench guy. I keep hearing him in my head. Is he a ghost? Haunting me? I doubt we're talking about a ghost in the traditional sense. But an echo, maybe. See, if he was killed by the service weapon, your gun, maybe it's his final thoughts recorded by the bullet in his brain, like a, a deep space probe sending back data. But that's just a hypothesis on my part. I need the gun to research it. <laughs> but you better hold on to that, given the circumstances. I think I will. So the bullet's connected to yeah. the gun, and when it entered his head when he shot himself, it read his mind. Oh, okay. okay. Can you tell me what an object of power is exactly? This is all, well, new to me. Yep. <laughs> Don't Same. worry, I love going over the basics. So objects of power are mundane objects that house paranatural energies and have developed a link to the astral plane and can thus be controlled, which is what differentiates them from altered items, which are still housings of paranatural forces, but are more volatile and cannot be bound in the peri-utilitarian sense. Got it? Did she memorize this? Nope. <laughs> she lost me. <laughs> Got it. Got it. Thanks. So HRA stop you from becoming hiss. It seems that way. I mean, I hadn't even heard of an HRA until a few weeks ago when Dr. Darling started handing them out. 
Well, I began analyzing mine as soon as I got it. I mean, each one seems to emit a powerful short range frequency way beyond anything I've ever seen. Doesn't the timing seem suspicious? I thought that too. Dr. Darling usually likes to unveil his latest breakthrough in big presentations. With these, he just passed them out. Yeah, his behavior makes me wonder what exactly he knew. Right. Well, thanks for talking, my dear. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Got a couple of questions just answered, let me know. but uh Yeah, are these all former directors? That's Trench, so that must be. Enter the communications department to find the hotline. Executive slash dead letters? Where are we? We are there. Executive affairs is south of us. Boardrooms, where we just were. Director's office. Oh, hello. We can add a mod. Damage after a kill plus 30. Okay, sure. Well, these personal mods uh, health recovery per element pickup energy energy let's get health hidden trend unidentified reading got clearance level okay uh emily instructs jesse to find the hotline okay yeah Wait, is that the same radio as before? Did we come from... Did, okay. Uh, I'm guessing we want to go to the gold marker, which means... This way, right? Seems to loop around... Back past the director's office. There's level four. We don't even have one. Hi. Unidentified reading. Okay, we have two of those now. I got my gun back, cool. I go this way. That's that door that's technically not open. So, back. Uh, I know you can't control building shift, but executive level restrooms has been missing for weeks now. <laughs> I worked my ass off in Islamabad station for three years. I've earned the right to, uh, for a nice workplace shitter. <laughs> Poor bastard. That was kind of hidden. House memory, that's another one of those things, just like the unidentified reading. Right, maybe it's because I'm on the wrong floor. Go for the ground floor along to it, maybe? Communication department, this way, okay. Dead letters. There it is again. A welcome message. There's level one. 
Have that. Want this to be true? Weapon armor damage mod. Travel costs. Uh, visited the following Nevada accommodations. Desert Sun Inn, Big Sky Motel, Starlight Motel, la yada la yada. Accommodations. I do wonder if a motel called Ocean View is going to be found in a landlocked state. But hey, I guess I'm not paid to think, right? And for the record, I again request that you give us the budget to the get two rooms each night. Agent Rowley and myself are very tired of sleeping in the same room. Hydrate, we'll do in a second, bud. You've been f messed up, man. Oh, this is one of these shift areas. Is that where I want to go? Things are getting stupid loud. Gotta let my gun recharges ammo it's yeah right I got told this game was maybe partially mildly sp I don't do spooky so, yeah don't know how I feel about this at all hmm oh we're in the men's room oh hello Always check your bathrooms. We got five of these now, okay. Shelter. Hello? Oh, no, 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 okay, I'm, I'm sorry, I'm not gonna go in there. This is... I don't know what's going on here. Banner summary. The auditory event occurred at the United States Embassy in Havana, injury, injuring the major... Uh, okay, injuring the majority of the de uh, diplomatic staff stationed there. Redacted deaths were reported. And outgoing information has been managed. The Bureau of Ratings survived at the embassy on the other day as the same as the event. Supported though the federal channels, or through the federal channels, but were too late to witness the AWE. Reported to have been redacted. Staff experienced sudden intense vibrations and noise accompanied by intense pressure in the ears. This lasted for redacted minutes. No visual phenomena w uh, was witnessed. The scene was con cordoned off, and the embassy staff were transported to the c um, continental U.S. After Formula I-9, I-9, I'm guessing, was uh, recited in the vicinity, recited the vicinity, a single cowboy boot began to vibrate, identifying it as an altered item. This item was contained and brought to the Bureau for examination. See case file. Oh, hello. There's something up there. Okay. Get... Ah! Ha ha! I go back. Yeah. 
You want to go this way. dream and I, I built the thing I saw in the dream a machine that will contain God but not the God you know or any or anyone knows a new God this machine will be the, his body his heart his mind I made it just like the dream showed me I used the motor from the refrigerator and the coils from the toaster the fans plus the time belt from my car's engine and the wheels from my son's skateboard God can't move yet but my dream said he would learn how on his own uh, uh, this is just a beginner's body, like a baby's, but uh, a machine instead. God only needs a place to start. If you want to interview me, please contact me at the address on the envelope. My phone does not work anymore. I had to use the dialing plate on God. Hey, Ken. Ken, this is spooky and I don't like it. <laughs> How you doing? Welcome on in. You have a shield? How do I get through your shield, nerd? Okay, just shoot, okay? Charge it up, charge it up, charge it up. Fuck you! Great Weaver. <laughs> yeah. You can already see it's setting off my neck tick. Which is going to be fun later when it starts to hurt. <laughs> Good times. Anyway. Please stop floating. Weird. Uh, greetings, Director Trench. I'd like to thank you for approving my request for the Dead Letters Archive, cataloging the Bureau's collection of delinquent mail. We provide an extremely hand will provide an extremely handy database that can research that the research teams can use to search for any connections or related topics found among the letters. Aside from the more functional purpose, this archive will allow us to preserve these windows into the authentic human encounters with the paranormal world. Letters came to us from various places and times gathered by the Postal Service as undeliverable. The Bureau is a perfect home for them. I realize not all letters contain accounts of genuine paranormal events, but even the uh, ero erroneous ones allow us insight into how the unknown is perceived by real people. Of course, I will first compile the system to allow us to analyze the letters for any information or suspected connections to the AWE. Um and other altered materials. So thank you again. Can't wait to delve into the dead letters. P. Bartwell. Alrighty then. Is that like a, a, a machine gun version of my pistol? Shatter projectile boost? Singing fish? What? called the police but they never come to my house I got a problem and you got to send folk to fix it I got my wife one of them singing fish on the walls it's not real it's not real fish it sings when you hit a button but it's got the devil within it it flies around at night and sings devil songs it says a lot of cuss words the devil uh, got in my house because the fish and you got to come and handle it my wife is really uh, real upset when can you come sincerely Darwin Barr Wayne Barr not Darwin Blech. words
Can we please stop with the whispering? Please? Oh wait, we, this is a control point. We can fix this. Yes. Cleanse the room. That looks so good though. I gotta give them that. That looks real clean. Oh, you're still floating. I don't approve. Communications department. I'll go in there in second. Just look at it. Eight inches wide and capable of storing a whopping 80 kilobytes. Damn, 80 kilobytes. friends at the CIA, the disk held the launch codes to Soviet nukes. Floppy disk. This is not the disk, of course, but one exactly like it. A perfect <laughs> fusion of concepts vibrating in the Cold War era collective unconscious. A receptacle. It is a receptacle for dangerous energies to hone in on. And they did. We don't have the details, but when things started flying around the disk, it was transferred to us. It's an object of power. Oh, OP. Oops. Oh, and it can launch things telekinetically through the air. Uh, today, oh, cool. We, we launched maybe three dozen pencils. And once, we even launched a cup. Damn, a cup. That's a powerful floppy disk. I have an eight. Oh, Jesus Christ, Ken. Communications are on the right track. Look, what's over here, though, real quick? Hold up. Oh, wait, that's just the other way around since the room fixed itself. Okay. Hello? And we're in the right place. The fuck? Oh. Dude just got knocked the fuck out by something. Object of power. Like of oh my god! We need to that. The frick? I don't know why she seems okay with this. I don't. But she's in something's launching shit at me. Oh shit. Run. Why did I come in here again? Is that the floppy disk? That is the floppy disk. It's throwing a lot more than pencils and coffee cups. Give me the floppy disk of power. Floppy disk slash nuke. Bomb slash kinetic. Touch us to believe, director. It's harder to hear you when I'm here. It's like the channel's been changed. The board's in charge here. Their pyramids in the bureau seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? I'm not their director. I'm no one's director. Oh, I'm a wizard. I'm a wizard now. Okay, that was like an on button. Just 
blast through a bunch of rocks. Avada Kedavra! Spilling Almas! Stupid fly! <laughs> okay, I'm a wizard. <laughs> 